I'm in the brand new Fiat Panda. So the Panda's been around quite a long time and it's quite a cult favourite. You know, like, um, quite a popular car, certain demographics. Um, and that has its reasons. Like, it is a very good car in general. Overall, it is a good car. It gets you from A to B, no fuss, and uh, quite funky looking. Steering is quite light, not a particular amount of feedback, but then again, the type of uh, purchaser of a car such as the Panda isn't going to be interested in stuff like that. So this model here is fitted with the 1.2 litre petrol unit, it's 69 horsepower. Just enough for a car of this size, um, by no means potent, but gets you from A to B without any fuss. Given it's relatively boxy shape, although still nothing in comparison to the previous model, you would expect um, road noise of some sort. But very little road and wind noise, and I have to say it's quite a, quite a pleasant place to be, even at higher speeds. So, the center console is pretty neat now, it's uh, no fuss, it looks very similar to that of the 500. Very comfortable car, suspension soaks up everything, even with this alloy spec model. I'm getting approximately 5 litres per 100 kilometres now my week with the car. Now, Fiat say you will get less, but um, I haven't been driving with economy on the brain. So, I have to say I'm pleasantly surprised with it. No need to top up then last week whatsoever. Very good car in general. Overall, it is a good car. It 